Good evening. I greet you first of all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And on behalf of our sitting president and soon to be new president, David Walter Granger. Minister Kemraj Ramjatan. Is there anybody here from East from Belt? Anybody from West from Belt? Anybody from Lane Avenue? Alright. First of all, I'd like to pick up the soldiers on the ground. I see O'Neill, DJ O'Neill, sitting on his back there, big up. DJ O'Neill representing East from Belt. I want to big up. My name Dennis Atwell. These are the men that work hard. Men like Albert Cromwell, AKA Poto. Yes, April and others, my name Warren Mitchell. Big them up, big them up. Let them pump. I love the people in Lane Avenue. The other day they tried to stay in the people there. The people there saw some strangers coming into the area. And they are vigilant people. They want to know, who are you? We never see you before. Lane Avenue don't encourage intruders. They don't want anything to disappear, the TV gone. No, 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 no. They're the Lord people. And they saw some strangers, and they politely asked, Who are you? Where are you going? We don't know you. Could you leave, please? We don't know you. And then the guy stayed in the people of name, saying, What the this and that and that. I ain't seen no bad behavior. Then have you people, then have you people, have you ever behaved? They lied. They were trained by a king liar. They call him Pharaoh the King Lion. And he wants to get back into power through the back door. But no, no, no. Power never. Power never. Let me tell you something. You see the canal there? You see that bridge that built there? For the people from the lane have you to walk safely? This government has been taking care of it, people. Don't stop the progress. You see the cars that are driving across these bridges smoothly on smooth roads. You see West Front Road. Anybody see West Front Road? Don't stop the progress. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, come March the 2nd, 2020. We have an important task. His Excellency David Otto Granger is requiring every one of you out here to get up. Your grandfather, your grandmother, everybody. Sister, cousin, auntie, uncle. You know they have some people that are disabled and they will have to get vote by proxy. Some may want to go vote themselves. They want to ensure that Uncle David go back in power. So if these old people want to come out, we call it on you, the young ones who are strong. You are called because you're strong. Lift them and bring them out. We want every vote. We don't want any more one seat drama. We are looking for a landslide victory. Don't stop the progress. This time around, we want Region 4 to come out 100%. The president said 88 to 5. I want 100%. We want to win this region big. We need a full turnout. We cannot afford to get anybody taken. No, we don't win. Yeah, we got both. We got win. Don't worry about foolishness. They've got to come out and cast your vote. Trust me. Me and people can get around. Yeah, I don't come out of the way past and see anybody left up on the window. 
We can get around the police and have to lock me up. I have to vote to vote. This is no fun. But let me tell you something. We only just began. Do I know the truth? We only just began. You know the truth? And I don't think so. I'm sorry, I really want to sing now. Uh, you all start laughing. The rain starts falling. And the rain starts falling. But we only just began. George Summit is on the rise. Region 4 is on the rise. That's right, that's right. The is on the rise. That's right. The oil has started shipping out. Barrels of oil is shipping out. And soon the money will be filtering down into Lane Avenue, West Front Road, East Front Road, East Lepentons, North East Lepentons, Castello. Soon the money will be filtering down. Don't be fooled by Pharaoh. We will be building overhead pass. You see everybody now, for the past four years, is everybody driving a car. Good evening, sir. You look beautiful at that time, at the wrong color time. Get the green and yellow time, come around. We will be building overhead driveways. You guys would have seen some developed countries because they have so much vehicle these streets are too small so we'll be having roads where you'll be driving over and so on I want you to put your hands together for the Minister of Public Infrastructure his name is David Patterson he has been doing a terrific job Don't stop the progress We wanted to get the second bridge going across the Damarara River. Oh wow! And that bridge, when you drive from the West Bank and you come over here, there will be a overpass pass where you drive over the East Bank Road. Likewise, when you leave here, you go to the West Bank, there will be a pass where you drive over the, the West Bank Road there. But there are some people trying to put spokes in between me. They're trying to hammer oh. the progress. They're coming up with all sorts of things to lose the land. But you see that bacon now near Pharaoh? That bacon now near Pharaoh. But that bridge will build. That bridge will build. Come March 2nd, 2020, we will put up no AFC back in power. Don't stop the progress. We want to see the continued progress that is being done in the education sector. We have been putting all those who drop out of school on the payroll government. They had a thing called no child left behind. Now, the only way that, that term is used, no man left behind, is out on the war field, in the battlefield. When you're fighting against the enemy, you don't ever leave the soldier behind, you know, you pick you up and you run with him. But when it comes to education, you cannot promote someone that fail. They will continue to fail because there's no repercussions for your lack of performance. You have to, many of you will remember when we go to school, if you fail, you're going to repeat that class. And the next year you're doing exceedingly well. So we want to give those persons opportunity that took for granted their education. And that's why those that went a little here while they end up in the drop-in center, they're not writing CXC and they're producing great ones. That means that these people were bright all along. But the fear of government had a strategy to stifle their progress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, come on. Stifle their de development, setting them up with drugs and all sorts of stuff. Them, then they're running up and shoot them down all around the place. But we don't earn the kind of money to buy guns and those kind of stuff. This is where really these things coming from. And putting it in the poor man's hand and then shooting them down. No longer will that happen. No longer. We are educating our people. They're getting qualified. Jobs are flowing. 
<laughs> if business are coming in, yeah, yeah. don't stop the progress. children so the city police are running. Now our children, we ask them, we want to be where you grow. I want to be a police one. They got the police and officers. What are they officers? How are you doing? They got rest from Belt Outpost. They got all the police officers there. They put a terrific job. Thanks to the leadership. Thanks to the upload AFC leadership. Minister Kevin Drempton and our Prime Minister candidate and President David Otto Brainchild. Our Gary Defense Force is in a better place. No longer are they hiring them old, old buses to travel around. They have a whole fleet of new brand buses. Progress. Don't stop the progress. No longer. No longer. Can those people next door, friends, we're not making an eyes and pass us. Not a blade of grass. We have a new sheriff in town. It's David David Potter. No way, never. Don't stop the progress. We are investing wisely. We're not only investing in our human resource, we're investing in our military. military. They're being fully equipped. And do you know that even the public servants, we have a whole lot of people being trained and they're graduating in huge numbers today. You can hear, you ask them, we want to be where you grow up. Some of them say, they want to be a permanent secretary. You could have never heard that before 2015. But now, the young people want us to go in all fields, not only become doctors and lawyers and so on. This government has been educating the nation from nursery to university. That is why when we vote up new AFC back in power on March 2nd, 2015, we will return free education from nursery to university. I'm sure there are a lot of people out here who never went to the hinterland. To Mali and let them. If you never went to those hinterland here, put your hands up. But well, quite a number. Guess what? Soon, I hear about the happy people in the hinterlands also that are age 60 and 70 and never see Georgetown yet. Now they're having opportunities to travel to Georgetown, the capital city of Ghana, for the first time. Because we are opening up the roadways, there's a road now being built and being tagged to travel from Latin to Georgetown. Buses will be traveling from Brazil to Georgetown. Don't stop the progress. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, from the time David Otto Granger, our president, and soon to be a new president in the new government. From the time he entered office, he set a standard. And that's what you call inspiring leadership. He gives everyone hope. When he touched on, I'm sure everybody here went to the stadium where we had an inauguration ceremony. Were you guys there? I can't hear you. From the time he touched on there, Look at how his security were dressed. Well dressed, decked out. Even the media, well dressed, decked out. No longer see people just running anyhow with the little bands dropping down and thinking they're running behind Piero with a key and cutting. Everybody was in order. Well dressed. That shows the kind of leadership and inspirational leadership. Immediately after he got into office, businessmen and businesswomen. Normal, the small man and the small woman and girl in the community came out and started cleaning up George from that crazy Dorban Park. Right next to Sparrow office was a smelling so stink. That was a stench. Look at that place now. Don't stop the progress. We only just began. We've done a whole lot. We're taking 
four years. And so, comrades, in order for us to go another mile, another 10 miles, another 100 miles, another 1,000 miles of development and progress, we need you to get everybody in your neighborhood, in the alleyways, on the byways, pick them up, even those that you see far by the way, say, clean them up, make sure they make sure they're gonna you care? Take them to both. We want a landslide victory, people. What do we want? A landslide victory. Don't stop the progress. But there are people to come. There's so much more I want to tell you. So much more I want to tell you, but however. Forward ever? Backward never. Don't stop the progress. From March the 2nd, 2015, and we will be celebrating. Raise the plus, let me see. We will be celebrating.